Hey everybody, Boone Wyatt with the 323 Concept Furniture Restoration here today. Uh, today we are tackling this beautiful buffet. Unfortunately, the pets uh, the pets got a hold of the two front corners on this buffet, so we are here to fix it. Uh, how do we go about this? We start with Mohawk's Epoxy Stick. This is a beige color, and just mix that together, and the goal is to get one solid color. You're mixing that hardener in completely. And once you get that all mixed together, you have about five to ten minutes to work with the product. So we're going to start by applying that to the corners, just get the, uh, the basic shape. Um, and this may take two coats to get it perfect, but um, the goal is to get it as smooth as possible so you don't have to sand off a whole lot at the end, because once it's hard, it's pretty hard and takes quite a while to sand it all off. So once you get it on there, um, we go in first with 150 grit, start working all those details. Want to make sure all the contours match uh, the surrounding areas. Um, so like I said, we start with 150 grit. Once we get uh, where we're happy with that, we'll go in with 220 grit and get it as smooth as possible. Um, when you rub your finger over the top, it should just feel like one uh, seamless transition. You don't want to feel any ridges um, of sort. Um, lastly, we're going in with some coloring. Luckily, I had some general finishes Persian blue that matched this custom buffet color um, just about perfectly. I did a little bit of toning at the end uh, and put some stain pins over the edges to give it that distressed look. But overall, in the end, turned out really, really well. I'll put a link in the description of the video where you can find this epoxy if you're interested. Thank you all so much for watching today. Um, if you like the video, hit, help us out and hit that like button. That really helps us out in the YouTube algorithm. And if you want to see future videos, don't forget to subscribe to the page and hit that notification bell and you'll get future updates. Thanks again for watching and we hope to see you all next time.